what is going on youtube welcome back to the channel lex express checking in with another racing game right because these games look phenomenal and this game right here is need for speed it's the ps4 edition from 2015 we're running it on the ps5 and let me tell you it looks beautiful if you don't believe me look at it right here now the game runs at night for the most part so obviously that helps it enhances the experience plus the rain the wet floor but the detail on the cars is is pretty spot on now i i did try to do this race before the video to get a feel for it because i haven't played this game in quite a while and um let's just say that i uh lost to say the least look at the the detail on the car <laughs> you know i customized it and uh, crashed it into the wall a couple times which i will be doing right now for you guys in just a second but yeah let me see i'm gonna change the i'm gonna change the camera angle so you guys so you guys can uh see throughout the race how it looks my god that's the first time i do it right baby wow 
That was a tough race. I was sweating bricks because I wanted to record this footage for the video. And I'm just like, oh man, I just crashed so much because the Lamborghini is so fast and so stiff to do those turns with. Oh man, we did it. Let's go. Woo! That was that was a close one. That's why I wasn't talking, guys. But yeah, people are still playing this game. Alright, let's see. Alright, what the hell? He hung up. Mission marked update. Alright, let's see if we could do another race. Oh, man. But yeah, look at how big the map is. There's tons of races to do. Um, you know, there's side missions, main missions, all sorts of goodies for you to get your hands on and enjoy the, the game. And, and story. The story is is nothing crazy. But, uh, you know, it's, it's kind of like, a, I would say, like a cheap Fast and Furious, if you will. Like the first movie. So everything that I have available to me right now is hard. But look, if it has the check mark, you're good to go. So this one, we're going to go to this one now. And we're going to teleport over here. But yeah, you don't really have to drive all over the map. Once, you, once you've driven and done you know, all sorts of races, you just teleport. You're right then and there. Um, you know, you could buy cars. You rack up money and points to level them up and, and, and customize it and all that stuff. Right now, obviously, I'm using this Lamborghini, which I've crashed like crazy. But this Lamborghini is extremely fast and extremely helpful in these harder races that appear later on in the game. And you could actually beat this game with a buddy of yours if you both download it. You can invite them to your race, and it it's, it's a lot of fun. Let's go. Oh man, another hard one right there. And bro, let me tell you, the car is so damn stiff to do these turns with. It's just so hard. You guys, I can't describe how sweaty I am right now from doing these races because not only has it been a while that I've played this game, but the Lamborghini is a stiff car. You don't really do drifting with a Lamborghini, you know? But yeah, that's the gist of it. You know, that's what the game is all about, you know? Uh, ultimately earning money let's let's go back to our garage that way you guys can see you know it's all about earning rep you know doing challenges doing the the campaign you know the campaign the, the cutscenes for the campaign it's a mix of you know the graphics uh from what you see now and you know real people so we're gonna head on over to the garage that way you guys could see you know the cars that i have in there and some of the the features that is available now if you guys have already played this game obviously this is more of like a ps5 showcase for you right and no, answer that call me. get over the longhorn we gotta talk uh oh so let's into the garage we'll talk to him later 
But I remember playing this game for the very first time. It blew me away, and it still it still holds up. In my opinion, I think the game still looks phenomenal. And it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. Even though the story is a little cheesy at times and the loading screens can get annoying, it's a lot of fun. So this is one of our cars. Let's see if... Uh, purchase car. No, let's... Where are my other cars? Did I sell all my other cars? Oh, okay, look. So we got this one for free. That one we, we earned uh, throughout the campaign. But I just want to put the Porsche there. That way you guys can see it. Um, my saves my, my saves uh, didn't carry over, you know. Because I, I played this on the PS4. So only the cars that I already had uh, through the campaign are the ones that are popping out. But at least my progress carried over, you know. But not the cars from the garage. Look at this car right here. So all sorts of cars. Um, I remember I had the the Nissan GTR, but for whatever reason it's not showing up. But it's okay. I'm not gonna spend money on that right now because we have we have the Lambo and we got this uh, Porsche right here. So let's check out the Porsche. Went to the warehouse. Swap from warehouse. Sell car. Select car. Let's select car. There we go. There's the Lambo. Here's this one, and let's, uh, we can't, we actually can't tune it, but we could, you know, move the camera around and enjoy the beautiful graphics that is need for speed. Now, the reason why I can't customize this one is because this was one of those pink slips races that I did in the campaign, but let's go to the Lambo here. Let's go back to the Lambo. Which, you could move the cars to your warehouse if you want to store all of them and stuff. So, you know, you could change the paint. Let's see here. Paint arrow. You could download some from online. Look at that. Super nice. Oh, God. Sorry about that, guys. But, yeah, look at this one right here. Super nice. Ooh, this one looks really dope. So yeah, you could do different wraps and colors and all that. That's for visuals. And then you could handle the tuning, which is something that I should probably do. So I don't freaking, you know, slip like you guys saw in the races. And you could do performance customization. And this is where, you know, where it goes down to make the game, the, the game easier for yourself. You upgrade, you know. These uh, these parts that you unlock through leveling up and using the car over and over. So that's Need for Speed for you guys. Again, this is the 2015 edition that came out on the PS4. We are currently playing it on the PS5 in case you guys forgot. Explain yourself. Man. No, Manu, it ain't right. Look, calm down. You gave uh -oh. me your word. <laughs> hey, look who's on. I get your ass over to the bar fast. Wow. Stuff to discuss, man. It's important. Spike. Oh, it's cool. It's cool, Manu. I'll see you all there. You want to see that what Spike has to say or what? You going over there, Manu? I can't make it. Looks like I got no choice. Hey, be easy on Spike tonight. He's going through a rough time, okay? Uh oh. We'll you later. What's going on with Spike, man? You want to check out what Spike has to say? Let's let's check it out so you guys can see the cutscene as well. And we're driving to Porsche now. Why not, right? It's a nice gameplay video. We've won two races on here. Let's let's check out Spike. Where's Spike at? Little Spikey. And um, you know, I don't know if you guys noticed when I was switching the camera angles, but this game, even though it does look good for the most part, this is the only thing you could see from the front of the hood. You cannot get inside the cockpit. Yeah, this game knew that they weren't going to work on the cockpit, so <laughs> they didn't even bother with it, honestly. Which is okay. I don't even drive in the cockpit, honestly. That's just to, like, showcase graphics, usually. So, Spike. Where are you, Spike? The Longhorn? I think Spike is over here, man. And I think Spike may be a little angry. So, let's let's go over there and talk to Spikey. Your character doesn't talk though. They they look at the camera and stuff, but like it shows you like like if you're talking to the other characters, but you're not really talking. Enter location. Yes, sir. Here we go. 
But look at that, man. Doesn't that look nice? If you guys like Need for Speed, comment down below for more racing. Uh oh, here we go. <laughs> oh, yo, hey, you're up. <laughs> hey, what's up? Hope you're better than this fool. <laughs> to see what you got. Get a drink? Yeah. Cool. Mm. Stick to driving. <laughs> yo, man. Hey, you okay? Which one was it, man? Huh? Was it the 277? Yeah? I bet you don't even know this, man. This is personal favorite. Yo, what's the beef, dude? Magnus offered this guy a drive. In one of his own 911s, no less. How did he even get your number, man? Huh? Hey, that right? What did you do? I gave it to him. Relax. Relax? Yeah. Relax? That was my right! I heard that! Mike, stop it! Chill, man. Come on. We're all on the same side here. Travis is just pushing you because he wants you to be great. I don't need his help. Now, new guy over here is getting all the credit. Yeah? What? Huh? Hey, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Seriously? Hey, I ain't no pushover, man. This is what you wanted. You're on Magnus's radar. One of us gets noticed, we all get noticed. It's a package deal. All right? All right. That's cool. Fool. I'm sorry, man. I now you want to apologize? So badly, you know? You're a little desperate, Spike. You good? We ain't good, dog. Let's get we ain't out good. Do this, man. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You must be doing something right. <laughs> I sure am. I'm kicking ass and taking names. So there you have it, folks. Need for Speed. That's the gist of it. Those are the cutscenes. These are the graphics. It's on the PS5. We're still having fun with it. Now, keep in mind that not all old games are backwards compatible. So I'm actually surprised that this game is even playable on the PS5 because it's not like the Xbox where not only does the Xbox auto HDR some of the older games, but every game that was playable on Xbox One is playable on the Series X. You know what I mean? That's not the case for the PS4 and PS5. So, guys, we'll be back real soon with some more racing. Next time, I will be probably showcasing Forza on the Series X because Forza really looks beautiful. That's a game that is worth checking out. So if you guys are into racing, subscribe to the channel. If you guys are into next-gen gaming in general, subscribe to the channel for more of everything. Movies, games, vlogs, unboxings. It's all here. Don't miss out, and I'll see y'all later. Peace.